morning, everybody. What is it? It's Saturday. Yeah, it's Saturday. And I already looked at the traffic, and it's um, <laughs> unbelievable. So, if I need to get onto the freeway, I have to go quite a distance before I can get onto it because I have to avoid Corona altogether. But uh, I'm not going to go anywhere today. Instead, I'm going to continue with what I'm doing in the kitchen. It would be so nice to get that finished. Um, I have work to do at Nikki and John still, and it looks like I'm not going to be able to do that till Monday uh, afternoon. I do have an interview on Monday. So, tomorrow I am going to go hang out with Dave, which I haven't done for a long time. So, looking forward to that. And right now I'm going to lunch. There's nothing in the house to eat. So I'll probably stop by the store, see if there's anything I can pick up. Hey guys, guess what? Good morning. I am finally getting to ah, the trees in the way. The Christmas tree shop. That's right. I've been trying to get here forever. Finally made it. I'll let you guys know what it's like when I come back out. Okay, so this is my next project that I'm doing. I have to finish the crown on the ceiling in the dining area. When I uh, worked on this, I just pulled it down without concern of what was going to happen, and I broke it up. So, and it broke up because stuff is made out of styrofoam. Now, it's probably been in there uh, for uh, a lot of years, and the possibility of me finding it is pretty remote. However, the front room is full of it as well. It's just painted this horrible brown color. So I am going to remove it all. It's all got to come down anyway. Oh my God, guys, we're cleaning out Pa's garage or my nephews are cleaning out Pa's garage and you'll never believe what they just found. You got to understand back in 1984, I believe it was, the Mets won the World Series and I was a huge, huge Lenny Dykstra fan and Tanya Longley 86? 86 86 Tanya Longley bought me this picture nails Lenny Dykstra with no shirt on believe it or not I went from loving a guy like this to my Daryl Dixon that's right so I pulled down the, um, the molding here in the front room and now the place looks really awful not that it looked really great out here in here to begin with, but uh, you know, it's being pulled apart now. Boomer likes it. I pulled down what was in the dining area as well because I had broken it. And right now I'm going to stick the corners in. I just cleaned those off. Okay, so this is my corner. Goes up on the, the ceiling like this. Like that corner there, nice white painted, looks good. Mine is diarrhea brown. I'm gonna paint them after I get them up. I don't see any point in painting them now because I'll have to paint them again after I've uh, caulked and filled holes. So uh, I got my gun and I will shoot them up into the ceiling to these three corners. tea all day but we had a very productive day we went to um, the bank we went to office depot and I got some a couple of pictures printed that I wanted printed I can talk uh, had them look at the iPad they couldn't do what we wanted them to do on the iPad um, then we went to the Christmas tree shop. I've been dying to get in there. You guys saw a little bit of that. Great store. Honey, I did buy a few things, but great store, great prices. 
and I got a collage picture frame so I can put pictures of my adventures together and put it on the wall. Mm -hmm. You guys will get to see it all once it's done. Yay! So excited. And then we went for breakfast and Best Buy and then home and my nephews were cleaning out the garage and I helped them do that and you guys saw what I found in the garage or what they found for me in the garage. That was exciting. I haven't seen that picture in a long time. So that was pretty exciting. So then I sat here on the couch and I fell asleep. <laughs> I'm exhausted and it is hot outside it is so warm out there or so hot not warm out there sweat was just dripping off of me while we were going through stuff it was so hot I know I live in California I should be able to handle the heat the heat is different here definitely different yeah so I didn't get to finish the cleaning like I wanted to today, but I will do that tomorrow because I am just too dang tired tonight to do anything else. So, uh, just going to relax, have a little bite to eat in a little while, and maybe watch some TV. Yep, I'm not even going to color. I'm too tired. My niece wanted me to color with her, and I couldn't even do that. I pretended, but I couldn't even do it. All right, so I've got most of the crown up in the dining room. Looks kind of weird right now. And I've got these corners, so I don't have to worry about cutting corners. So it's got a 90 degree cuts on it. How, and over here as well, inside corners. However, I do not have an outside corner. But what I do have is a, what's called a return. And this is a return. So it's just an end that returns to the wall. So I'll show you that. I'm going to turn, create an outside corner using two returns. Okay, so these are my returns. I have a, uh, a left return and a right return. And what I need to do is cut the return off on both of them. And I should have a 45 degree uh, outside corner. Now I have two sets of these just in case I screw up the first and hopefully this works out. I'm going to be doing it on my um, chop saw. Okay, so this is as close to a 45 degree angle as I'm going to get. Nothing's going to be perfect here. And I'm just going to get some super glue and glue them together. And I will be filling the edge with caulk before I paint. Alright, crown is done. It just needs a unified paint job. I have to caulk first. And uh, that will be done. Hello everybody. I finally took a shower after I took a nap. Mm -hmm. I feel much better now though. Um, still very, very tired. So I'm going to call it an early night. Yep. An early night. I think it's nine o'clock. And I'm already in bed. Anyway, I hope you all enjoyed what you saw. Not sure what Kevin did over there in California, but uh, if you did enjoy watching, please give us a thumbs up, a like, a subscribe, a comment, all that happy crappy stuff, and we'll see you all tomorrow. Bye.